The South Indian Rebellion, 1800 to 1801. In this module, you will learn about the South Indian Rebellion and the role of the Marudu Pandyar brothers as the heroes of the rebellion. The South Indian Rebellion was the outburst of the accumulated hatred and anger of the masses towards the East India Company. The company interfered in the matters of local principalities, thus reducing the power and prestige of the local rulers. The princes and the polygars lost their dignity and respectable status in society. Oppressive administrative policies, ruthless methods of tax collection and the superiority complex of the British severely affected the people. By following the mercantile policy of gain, the British increased the taxes and collected it in a high-handed manner. Cutter Bowman was hanged and his relatives were severely punished. All these factors made the rebellion inevitable. The Marudu Pandyar brothers were amongst the main heroes of the South Indian rebellion. They served loyally under the leadership of Muthu Vadukanath Deva of Sivaganga. On Katta Bowman's death, they provided protection to his brother, Omathurai, and others. This was not appreciated by the merchants of Sivaganga. Anticipating a struggle, the brothers prepared themselves to face any attack from the British. This greatly alarmed the British, who sent their force under Colonel Agnew to fight against the Marudhu Pandyar brothers. Realizing the severity of the situation, the brothers issued a proclamation asking Indians to unite with the British. A copy of this proclamation was pasted on the walls of the gateway of the Nawab's palace in the fort at Trichy. Another copy was pasted on the walls of the great Vaishnava temple at Sri Rangam, where they invited all people to join in the struggle against the British. The conflict with the British started on May 29, 1801. In this, the rebels were defeated at various places, and Dindigul, Madurai, and Ramnad came under the control of the British. The Marudu Pandyar brothers went into hiding in the Singam Puneri forest. However, Tondaiman of Puddukotai captured them and handed them over to the British. The Marudu Pandyar brothers were hanged on October 24, 1801 AD, and Umathurai was impaled at Panchalan Kurichi on 16 November 1801 AD. This brought the South Indian rebellion to an end. Let us now recap all the important points that we have covered in this module on the South Indian Rebellion, 1800 to 1801.